How you guys doing again? This is Stan Benjamin Teacher Sasu here today working on this Disney design. Alright, sometimes people send you designs off of Etsy. I like to go with the flow because obviously if they send it to you, they like it. But then again, I definitely like to switch it up. So this one I just use a different font from what they sent me. Alright, here we go. So I'm just going to start by typing the name in there that I need, which is Mama. Alright, and copy that, place the other one, Mama Mouse. Alright, so I got a general font there. I'm going to go ahead and make a new layer. Always work on new layers. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and pull in my character. And I'm just going to remake this with circles. It's real simple and easy. Alright, now I'm going to go ahead and make a copy again. I'll try to lay it out into my design. And delete the O, which is replacing. I'm just playing with the uh, layout of my the, the ears on my Mickey Mouse, which is actually Minnie Mouse. I add the bow to her. All right, now I'm going to correct the spacing, and I'm going to go ahead and uh, weld my image together. All right, as you guys know, me personally, I like overlapping, so I'm going to go ahead and add the stroke to it, and then bring it to the front, so now it overlaps it a little bit. I'll play with it exactly, get it where I where I like it, which looks good. So I'm just going to take one of the bows off my previous design and overlap it on top of the mouse. All right, I'm just going to put these circles behind here, just so that it's filled in with white. Real lazy. All right, and I'll send them to to the back of the bow, and now we're good to go. Alright, so now all I have to do is get it positioned right the way I like it, which looks good here. Alright, now I'm going to go ahead and remove it. Now all I got to do is make a new copy of this. Alright, now move the actual text layer back over top so it's lined up perfectly with the other the spacing goes so now that when I change this to mi uh, mini alright so now we got the midi and the center lined up perfectly alright now I'm going to put them next to each other and now here's where I'm going to go ahead and get it prepared for cutting All right, I'm just going to drag the bow off to the side so it's not touching anything Alright, and again, um, I'm going to go ahead and leave the dots because I want to lay it out where it's white there. Alright, so I left the dots over. It's not perfect, but when you layer these in uh, vinyl, you won't even notice uh, that it's cut out the way it is, but it'll give you perfect spacing. Alright, so now I have my black image, and I'm going to pull it off to the side. So now I have an actual cut file to work with. Now I'm just going to save it. And that's pretty much it. So, as you guys can see, real simple text layout. Um, all you need to do is create outlines and work with it a little bit. It's not anything really challenging. You can grab images off of Google, like that bow that I used out of another file came off of Google. It's been Stan Banks with T-shirt Side Hustle. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and do all those good things. Happy printing.